Oh, Canadian Soccer Association. I don't know what to say. On today's episode, we will take a look at the list of players called up by Dragon Skocic and Iran's possible upcoming opponents. You know the deal, and you know what time it is. It's time for Team Ellie Talk. A huge setback in Iran's preparation for the 2022 FIFA World Cup. Hey everyone, glad you're back for another edition of Team Ellie Talk. We all know about Canada canceling the scheduled friendly match with Iran that was supposed to be played in Vancouver on June the 5th. But first, let's take a look at the list of players that were called up by head coach Dragan Skocic. First, the goalkeepers, Ali Reza Bayron Vand, Amir Abedzadeh, and Hossein Hosseini. Next, the center backs, Majid Hosseini, Hossein Kanani, Aref Golami, and Aref Agassi. The wing backs, Sadek Moharami, Saleh Hardani, Omid Nurafkan, and Milad Mohammadi. Now for the midfielders. Saeed Ezatullahi, Esan Hachafi, Omid Ebrahimi, Ahmad Nurolahi, Mehdi Mehdipur, and Milad Sarlak. Now for the wingers slash attacking midfielders. Ali Reza Jahan Bash, Ali Golizadeh, Mehdi Torabi, and Amir Hossein Hosseinzadeh. Last but not least, the forwards, Sardar Azmoun, Mehdi Tarami, Alayar Sayad Manish, and Ali Alipur. Out of all the players on this list, there are two players that I am really excited about. First, really happy to see Omid Ibrahimi return to Team Meli. I really think Dragan Skocic watched my recent interview with assistant coach Mario Tot. Now the bottom line is that Iran definitely needs help at the central midfield position, and Omid Ibrahimi is the man who can work really well with Saeed Ezatullahi. Next, great to see Ali Alipur back with Team Ali. He has only made three appearances for Iran, but he had a great season with Maritimo, scoring seven goals. And he recently signed with Gil Vicente, another club that is also in the top level of football in Portugal. We all know that Sardar Azmoun, Mehdi Tarmi, and Alayar Sayad Manesh are basically locked in at the striker position for Iran. But Ali Alipur might have a chance at beating out Kari Mansari Fard or Shahab Zahidi for one of the final roster spots at the 2022 World Cup. Recently, things were looking good. Iran was scheduled to play friendly matches against Canada and Ecuador, two teams that qualified to the 2022 FIFA World Cup. But unfortunately, both matches were canceled. And here is what Sardar Azmoun had to say about what happened. We have become a plaything for the Canadian Soccer Association. I am sorry that the match got cancelled. I hope that this will not happen in the future. Mixing sports and politics. It is not the right of athletes. I feel sorry for the youth of Iran. Long live Iran and Iranians. Now, this is a frustrating situation because Iran has been grouped with tough opponents at the 2022 World Cup and getting friendly matches against quality opposition is extremely important. As we know, it is hard to trust a lot of media sources involving the national team of Iran. And recent reports have revealed that Iran may be planning friendly matches with the Democratic Republic of Congo or Cameroon. Like I said, only rumors. But another source is reporting that Iran is likely to play Uruguay at the Centenario Stadium in Montevideo on June 11th. I hope this happens, but let's wait and see. Thankfully, Uzbekistan is unavailable because of Asian Cup qualifying. And if Iran schedules a friendly match with Syria, I'm just going to snap. Now to finish off this edition of Team LA Talk, I must express my disappointment. And actually, my disappointment is not with the Canadian Soccer Association. Instead, I'm actually disappointed about the division amongst Iranians. And as we know, our Team LA footballers work so hard on the pitch to make us smile and to give us a reason to jump for joy. And it's disappointing to see our Team Melly footballers and coaches, you know, miss out on a very good friendly match because of non-football reasons. But having said all that, from this moment forward, I will not be focusing on anything that happened in the past. We need to be supporting our Team Melly footballers and coaches, and all I want is for Team Melly to get some good friendly matches 
and be ready for the 2022 FIFA World Cup. And that's it, everybody, for this edition of Team Melly Talk. As always, really do appreciate the support. Make sure you get to our website, www.teammelitalk.com. Remember, this is your best source for the latest news on Team Melly, the national team of Iran. Make sure you find us on social media, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. You know the handle, at Team Melly Talk. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. Hit that notification button. See you on the next edition of Team Melly Talk.